Welcome back to the Kaboom guy. You know already from the title. You know how much I love this gun. You do, right? You know, maybe most of you guys are here because you searched how to fix your Walter P22. I'm pretty sure there is thousands of you guys having a lot of problems with this um, pistol. I hate it. I literally hate this gun. Uh, I'm trying to fix it today, but I'm gonna give it a chance. I hope this wind doesn't bother the sound. It probably does. I hope you guys can hear me. I have another video. I'm trying three or four different brands of uh, 22 long rifles to see if that makes a difference. I think out of four different brands, he actually performed okay with one of the brands. We didn't have any pr uh, problem with that, but other than that, bunch of problems. Failure to eject, uh, failing to chamber around, and then failing to extract around, you name it. And it's horribly, horribly, um, I, how do I say that, accurate? No, it's not accurate, that's what I mean. Absolutely not accurate. Every time he shoots different locations. I'm gonna try to fix it though, but I'm gonna give it a chance first. This time, a friend of mine, a good guy from Precise Armory, he gave me this box of 22s and he told me try this Winchester to see if it's gonna make any difference. Let's see what it is. It's 40 grain and travels at 1,280 feet per second. I'm going to load one magazine. I'm going to shoot it. If we don't get any problems, I might not attempt to fix it. <laughs> if it gives me a problem, then I'll definitely try my trick to fix it. Let's see. What do you think? Let's go give you a problem. Perform good? Let's go give you a problem. Hopefully. I'm hoping it does. Because this is all this video is about. Hopefully it gives me a problem so we can fix it. So you guys can learn from it and fix yours. <laughs> We're all about that. You ready? Ready. Eyes and ears. All right. Clean. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> it worked. Let me try it again. I really <laughs> want it to fail. <laughs> Do we post this video even? Is there a point to it? Do you think I should still fix it? Do you have another gun you can fix? <laughs> no, I want to fix this one. <laughs> I really hate it. Another Mac. Come on. Fail, please. Oh. <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> Got stuck. Please. God damn it. <laughs> Another time, one more time. <laughs> one more time. Dude, every single time this gun jammed on me and now that I want to fix it, it's not jamming. It's scared. It's scared. <laughs> <laughs> you know what it's coming to me. Oh, All right, come on then. All right, I'm gonna use this lever to load it. See if it's gonna do the same thing. No, I load. Ah, man, <laughs> this is not good. Ah, yeah, failed. <laughs> yes, <laughs> it did it again. Again. Again! Ah, it's happening. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes. All right, now that you can see my trick, let's clear this weapon first. There's still one in the chamber. We're getting a knife. It is clear. Now it is time 
to fix it. I'll be right back. Finally, <laughs> time for fix it. Oh, you saw something in my hand, you should have done. So, you first thing that you do, this is really gonna work, trust me. First thing that you're gonna do is clear your weapon, make sure there's nothing in there. It is clear, put the magazine, magazine has to be in the gun. You have to have some kind of a 4x4, 2x4, something like that. Make sure your gun stays completely uh, still? still, right, like that. You have to have a GoPro, that's very important. You have to make sure your GoPro is rolling. Just stay with the camera on this side, do not film me, I'll be right with the tool that I made for it. <laughs> Here's the tool. Hey, You're gonna grab a 12 gauge? Yeah, we're gonna be back when, when we're using our tool. You need a slug, make sure it's one ounce 12 gauge stock uh, slug. You load your weapon, you get further, you say, this is very important, you say kaboom, kaboom, you aim at the water, I hate you, kaboom, kaboom, <laughs> that's how you fix a Walter P22. I forgot to show you how I fixed it. Magazine now works perfectly. That's your stock. That's the barrel. No, there's nothing left of this gun. <laughs> <laughs> there's your slide, slightly bent. That's where the slot got an impact right on the gun. It should be like that, something like that. That's the barrel. There's some other parts. And what I can tell you, this Walter is perfectly fixed. As I told you, thank you for watching. I hope I see you next time. And just put a comment, uh, write down in the comments it's if your, this trick works on yours. But it definitely did on mine.